Hello, and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is number 587. The category is Random Trivia Pub Quiz number 10. This is one of the 21 question trivia quizzes that includes questions from several different categories. Some are easy, some are hard. They all come together for a perfectly sized pub quiz. Thank you for watching. Good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. 30 minutes of exercise every day will help improve your body's ability to use insulin, the hormone that regulates levels of what monosaccharide, also known as blood sugar? The answer is glucose. Question number two. In America, where noble titles are constitutionally forbidden, the esteemed professional designation Esquire is typically used to identify a person who is in what career field? The answer is lawyer or practicing law. Question three. Which Shakespeare play features the line, see how she leans her cheek upon her hand? Oh, that I were a glove upon that hand, that I might touch that cheek. The answer is Romeo and Juliet. Question number four. Although ringed seals and bearded seals are the primary food for what type of bear that can weigh 1,600 pounds, there have been records of them bringing home beluga whales for dinner as well. The answer is polar bears. Question five. Played by America Ferrara, what was the title of the sitcom that ran for four seasons back on ABC from 2006 to 2010, where the title character was the assistant to the editor of the fashion magazine, Mode? The answer is Ugly Betty. Question six. William Smith Monroe, commonly known as Bill Monroe, was an American mandolinist, singer, and songwriter who is known as the father of what colorful music genre that was named after his band? The answer is bluegrass. Question seven. In the early, early years of America, what man seceded John Carver as the governor of Plymouth Colony in 1621 and then continued to serve for 31 of the next 35 years? The answer is William Bradford. Question number eight. Stuck between Austria and Hungary, since a national split in 1993, Bratislava is the only world capital city that borders two other countries. What country is Bratislava the capital of? The answer is Slovakia. Question nine. 
In the King James Version of the Bible, what is the three-word prepositional phrase used at the start of the first sentence in the first book of the Old Testament? The answer is in the beginning. Question 10. What pious 10th century Bohemian ruler was only in his 20s when he died, but the story of him braving harsh winter weather to give alms to a poor peasant on the Feast of Stephen immortalized him in a Christmas carol? The answer is King Wenceslaus. Question 11. Shortly after it was commissioned in 1943, Franklin Delano Roosevelt came aboard the USS Iowa battleship and traveled to Tehran for an important meeting with what two other world leaders? The answer is Stalin and Churchill. Question 12. What is the word that in Old Latin means under or beneath, but in the English language it can mean a sandwich or a nickname for a deep sea vessel? The answer is sub. Question 13. What is the title of the 1990 Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan movie where Hanks' character is diagnosed with an incurable disease, so he quits his dehumanizing job and wishes to live like a king and die like a man? The answer is Joe versus the Volcano. Question 14. Saccharomyces cerevisiae, or sugar-eating fungus, is a long name for a small species of what that causes bread dough to rise and allows beer to ferment? The answer is yeast. Question 15. What is the name of the city located in the southwestern corner of Germany's Black Forest near the border with France with a double talk name that has been home to soothing baths since the Roman times? The answer is Baden-Baden. Question 16. The requirements for the Medal of Honor were standardized among all the services, requiring that a recipient had distinguished himself conspicuously by gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his life above and beyond what? above and beyond the call of duty. Question 17. Including his 1874 novel, Far From the Matting Crowd, what popular author set many of his works in an area of England called Wessex? The answer is Thomas Hardy. Question 18. 
Originally named for the three rivers that converged there, the city of Three Forks, Washington changed its name in 1884 to honor what sleeping train car innovator who had given it an endowment? The answer is Pullman for George Pullman. Question 19. The fruit jar drinkers, the gully jumpers, and the possum hunters were among the early performers on what popular American country music radio show? The answer is the Grand Ole Opry. Question 20. Usually born two at a time, weighing one half to one pound, with their eyes closed and without fur, what is the term for any type of bear's newborn or young offspring? The answer is a cub. That is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode. Check back tomorrow. We'll be doing a Brainy Tuesday, which is similar to today's trivia, but the questions will be just a little bit harder. Tuesdays are the tough days. Friday we'll be doing Trebek Trivia, which are the little bit easier and more pop culture questions. We have several good trivia quizzes coming up this week and next week. And then I'll actually be gone again the week after that. I'm trying to get some. Hopefully next week I'll be able to double up the quizzes that I get done. So the days will go uninterrupted and there will be a quiz on every day that third week in August. So that's the plan. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being patient. Hopefully you're enjoying these quizzes. We are enjoying making them. Here is question 21 for today, the tiebreaker. One of the men was born in Kentucky, one in New York, and the two other men on Mount Rushmore were born in what American state? The answer is George Washington and Thomas Jefferson. Those were the two born in Virginia, then Theodore Roosevelt was born in New York, and Abraham Lincoln was born in Kentucky. Thank you for watching today. Check back tomorrow. Have a good week.